There we go. Light looks all right. This is too tangled. All right. Sound going okay. All right, this is going to be a little bit of a shorter one, but that's not a big deal. All right, let's do this. Welcome all you plus two comedy modifiers back. TV's Noah here, and let's do a thing. Yay! So you might be thinking, what is uh, Let's Do a Thing? Basically, it's a stream where we sit down and we do a thing. There's a bunch of things I want to do. I want to go out for game shows. I want to do video essays. I want to investigate websites. I want to do math. I want to do math for some reason. Uh, but I realized that uh, you guys may know me as the host of Stay Doomed or the guy who solves not prawn riddles or perhaps a wrestling commentator. But in my soul, deep down, I'm a stand-up comedian. And I find out that, uh, personally, I have trouble doing things without an audience. So, let's do a thing is me doing all the things I want to do, but we're going to do them with an audience. So these are various things that we're going to do. It'll be different every single week. So that is, let's do a thing. So let's, uh, let's get ahead and get to it. Let's do a thing. This is the thing we're doing for the first episode. We're going to take the Jeopardy quiz. So I looked into it, and apparently the way you get on Jeopardy is there is a scheduled test you have to take. There's only certain times where you're allowed to take this, like, audition test. And to get to the audition test, you have to take the Jeopardy Anytime test. And, you know, that Matt character has been on a tear on Jeopardy. And uh, someone's got to dethrone him. Why not me? Why not TV's Noah Houlihan going on Jeopardy, winning $700,000? So we're going to try it today. Today, we're going to take the Jeopardy quiz. So let's, let's jump into this. Okay, so there's a little preview we can watch. So this is what will be asked of me. The test launches after a 30 second countdown. All right. You have 15 seconds. I was to reading respond that question. Each clue. 15 seconds is not a lot of time. Do not respond in the form of a question. Okay, cool. Trees and reasons. Respond right. with last names only unless otherwise directed. Oh, all right. You will not be penalized for minor uh, misspellings. Red herring. Do your best to be phonetically yeah, I got correct. One. The test consists of 50 clues from 50, 50 clues. categories. Ready? Good luck. All right. Let's do it. Let's do the thing. Yeah, there he is. Madam Adios. I'm coming for you. I'd love to be able to just do the college one, but anytime adult. I'm one of them anytime adults. All right, so I've never taken the Jeopardy test before. We'll see if, uh, if I'm worthy of doing this. So we got 30 seconds to kill, I think, after I start this. I already so thought I signed in. Okay, so let me do, 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 do. Actually, let me, let me go full screen so I don't give away my phone number. There we go. You can only submit the test once. Each person has a limited number of attempts. Do not close the test window before finishing the test. You can't save and finish. Your answers will not be saved. Uh, answer every question. Partial response and misspellings will still be considered. Ooh. Please add Jeopardy contestants at spe.sony.com and Jeopardy contestant search. Uh, to your address, book, or contacts to make sure you receive updates in your inbox. All right. We're going to start the test now. Here we go. Feeling good. Oh. All right. I'll move this more center here. All right. We got 20 seconds, and then we'll do the thing. I'm sure this is not public domain, so I'm not sure how this will 
will figure in on uh, <laughs> Twitch copyright strikes. Oh God. 20th century names, let's go. He was the second man to walk on the moon, uh, Aldrin. Boom. Initial TV. Mark Hammond investigates all crimes inve involving U.S. Navy. Um, JAG? I believe that's JAG. Astronomical terms. Each year brings two of these days. One. Oh, um, uh, Equinox. Spell that great. Europe. You feel free to guess in the chat. Uh, terms for the partly Arab Muslim people who ruled medieval Spain. Um, Persian. Ah, I didn't hit submit. <laughs> Political groups. In 1937, this Spanish merged the fascist finance groups with, the, oh my God. Uh, uh, Go stop. Po. Ah, crap. Rhyme time. <laughs> a person who finally arrives at midnight to take you to the prom. Uh, that would be a late date. Bang. Got that one. Scientist. This Cosmo host. Tyson. <laughs> Asian capitals. This planned city for Pakistan's main religion became the nation's capital. Uh, of Pakistan? I have no idea. I have no idea. <laughs> Basketball terms. I should be okay. A player who finishes a game with 10 or more points, uh, that is a triple double. Three categories of double digits. President First Lady. She appeared in her husband in 1961 episode. Ooh. Uh, 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 oh, <laughs> classic American lit. In Long Island's West Egg, he's a mysterious wealthy neighbor to Nick um, Gatsby. Sure, Gatsby. Go. Mythological places. This should be good. Bifrost, the bridge that connects Earth with the home of the gods, was one of these colorful things. It was a rainbow bridge. Boom. Out of space. Captured by the Event Horizon Telescope, the first ever image of these was captured. That's a black hole. Boom. Plays. That should be good for me. In this Chekhov play, MME, Ranofsky is the owner of the title area of land. Uh, Rush, Russia. <laughs> Eight letter words. That's a lot of things to type. A temporal elevated platform for workmen or hangmen. Uh, scaffold? Hey, prophets. Cocktails. This should be good. Carrie Bradshaw of Sex and the City made this cocktail. Uh, I think that's a Cosmo. Boom. Musicians. Penned by Jen Walton Johnson, the song Do This and Sing became American, African American National Anthem. Do This and Sing. Dance? Dance and Sing? Hoofed Animals. Horse! A young cow is called this until she gives her a calf. Maybe a Betty or something? I'm going to go with calf. Ah, go. TV action series. Okay. Master Poe and Master Khan were Kane's teachers in flashbacks in this 1970 series. Um, fall Guy. <laughs> Spelled way wrong. Adjectives. Okay, English teachers should get this. A body part beginning with an eight-letter adjective for a man who is pleasing to the eye. Eight-letter adjective for a man who is pleasing to the eye. Hunk. That's not eight letters. Vital organs. I'm getting tired. The theme membrane called the endodermis lies the exterior of this organ. Skin? 
Handsome. Very. Well, that's, is that a bot? Oh, handsome. Uh, the smiley face symbol can be seen throughout this graphic. No oh, yeah, baby. Watchmen. Pop stars. Okay. This singer's hits include Thank You, Next, and No Tear. Oh, that's um, Ron Day. <laughs> Uh, the Southern Hemisphere is this island, the world's fourth largest, is separated from Africa. Um, for, uh, uh, New Zealand. Nah, damn it. The Book of Genesis. I should be good. Uh, his three sons were Shem, Ham, and... Um, Saul? Am I remembering this correctly? And we're going with Saul. <laughs> Bodies of water. Sandusky Bay is the inlet of Lake Erie in this state. Michigan. Two act two art terms are used to describe the orientation of paper in a computer printer. Landscape and the uh, portrait. Come on, there we go. Whew, stamps. All right, stamps should be good. A 2020 stamp featuring this national park named for the curve in the Rio Grande. National park. Uh, Yellowstone. I have no idea. Fix it. Felix. Placed in orbit in 1990, it was repaired by um, uh, uh, Hubble Telescope. Something worth seeing, this waterfall on Zimbabwe's river is twice as wide as Niagara Falls. I have no idea. I have no idea. I have no idea. I couldn't... There are other named waterfalls? Soundtrack. This should be good. Space Jam. City of Stars, Mia, and Sebastian's theme are on the soundtrack of this song-filled theme. Uh, Mama... Mia. Boom. Notorious. This Italian-American became synonymous with Get Rich uh, Ponzi. Lots of typos. Films of the 1930s. He played the tramp who befriends a millionaire and falls in love. Oh, oh, uh, what's his last? Uh, Chaplin. Kaplan. <laughs> Chaplin. U.S. Majors. The Majors have included Richard M. Daly and... What? It's Majors? Uh, the Army? What? I don't even understand. Oh, Mayors. Uh, I'm an idiot. Never mind. <laughs> Government agencies. Uh, it's a three-letter abbreviation for agencies that license private and commercial aircrafts. FDA? No. I have no idea. I'm bad. <laughs> Founders. The mustachioed yachtsman not only founded a tea company, but affixed his own portrait to the packages. Uh, not, a, not a clue in this world. <laughs> Exploration. We presume that this man made the first European sighting of late... Um... Uh, uh, Eric, Leif Erikson, son. Recent best centers. Uh, the concert Whitehead novel named for the 19th century path to freedom, its actual tracks and engineers. Uh, I have no idea. No idea. On the Anirondack. Called the Pearl of the Anirondacks is on the Dalmatian coast of this country. America. <laughs> Ephonyms. A coil and a unit of magnetic flux density are named for this scientist who died in 1943. Edison. Shakespeare! Give me Shakespeare in his 18th science. Shakespeare shall, shall I compare thee to a tree? 
Tesla. You're probably right. Starts with an L. The pursuit of a legal case. Uh, litigation. Litigation. 18, 1860s. The first venture transfer, transportation of a 1860s message. First venture transportation. Oh! Pony Express. Go! Percussion. Crash or uh, symbol. Symbol. I can't spell. I'm dyslexic. Historical dramas. Uh, the Royal Hunt of the Sun dramatizes the story of the... And this explorer. Um, uh, Smith? John Smith? I have no idea. A Broadway show. This is where Guinevere asks author... Oh, um, spam a lot. Symphony nicknames. Schubert Symphony number eight is known by this not Emmy name. <laughs> Women authors. Her daughter Rose entitled many of her little house books. Oh, on the I don't know. It, oh. I'm also reading too fast, and it's like, and trying to talk. This is bad. Trophies. It is a common name for both the International Yacht Race and the race tr Race's Trophy, formerly the Hunter Guinea Cup. Nope. No clue. <laughs> One more question, baby. Women in the news. Often known by three initials, this newsmaker was elected to Congress from the Bronx and Queens in... Uh, oh, RBJ. You've completed the test. Your responses have been submitted. Whew. That was exhausting. <laughs> oh, my God. So... Let me just take a look at what the, the chat was saying in there because I, I see Profit showed up. Uh, so this is a, let's do a thing. We're just going to do a weird thing every Friday. This Friday, I'm taking the Jeopardy test. Uh, yeah, so, yeah. Maddock got it. I'm doing something weird every week. Uh so how did how did I do? I know I definitely got a few things wrong. I think you're definitely right that it was Tesla, not Edison. Um, I definitely screwed up when I read majors instead of mayors, because had I at least read the word right, I could have guessed one of the fifty states, because it was asking for the state, right, or possibly the city. So I probably would have said like New York, or like Chicago. Whatever I could have spelled. Um, so, apparently this has to be like manually graded. Let's go, uh, we'll go full screen as I explain this. So, this has to be manually graded. So, uh, unfortunately, we can't see how I did. <laughs> At least not immediately. We'll have to come back for that. Uh, so, I think I can take the college one. Even though I'm not in college, I'd like to just take the test and see if it's easier and if I feel more confident about it. So uh, let's see if we can do that. Boom. Oh, wait a minute. There's a whole thing here. Let's take a look at this. Boom. Do not share your test material. <laughs> what? Help us maintain the integrity of this newly available availability of this anytime test. You didn't get any help. I mean, so why should you make the test easier for anyone else? Your test submission will be given to the Jeopardy uh, contestant team for evaluation. If you pass the test, you'll be placed into a random selection process for an invitation for a contest audition. Auditions are ongoing, and depending on our travel and testing schedule, you'll receive an invitation anytime for the next 12 months 12 months oh man so this is gonna there's gonna be a 
long gap between now and the follow-up video about whether or not I passed. If you were invited for an in-person audition, you'll take another 50 question test. If you pass that test, at least 35 correct out of 50. If, if I got that number, if I got 35 out of 50, I just made it. Like, already, see, am, am I disqualified for sharing or do you think I got it? Got more than 35 uh, wrong. I, I, I don't know. There's definitely a couple where I was just uh, shrugging my shoulders, but there's some I know I nailed and there's some that I had an idea of. So who knows? Um, what just happened? Oh, sorry about that. Uh, if you don't hear back from us within 12 months of your anytime test, it could be for a number of reasons. You may not have passed the test, or you may have passed, but we were unable to invite anyone who passed to attend an in-person audition. However, we encourage you to take the test again or participate in the next Jeopardy! test event. For more information, check out the FAQ. Uh, all right, I think, I, think, uh, I think now it might be uh, time for more Jeopardy. I don't know what the Jeopardy 6 is, but we'll, we'll give that a try next. This is Jeopardy. This is Jeopardy? All right, let's play now. All right, let's see how I, I how I fare. Today we start off with these categories. Oh. Let's go to work. I didn't expect to hear Alex. That's nice. We, the people. Oh, oh. we. <laughs> uh, a familiar cry of poker players revealing, uh, read them and weep. What is weep? I'm already done. I was thinking New Zealand too. I just panicked. A more perfect union. Marry your Christopher Guest. Oh, um, Jamie Lee Curtis. Thank you, Game Grumps. What is a hunk? Yeah. Hunk. General, I'm sorry I'm not reading out loud. I just don't have enough time. Soda men lower your risk. Uh, corn chip. This constitution. Um, a uh, second. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. We'll go, we'll, let's, let's begin Double Jeopardy and see how we do. Feel free to guess in the chat as well. I may or may not ignore you. Today we start off with these categories. Just I'm reading so fast. Let's, go to work. let's visit Mars. Let's. I want to visit Mars. Two, two, two books in one. Jimmy Hendrix. Uh, uh, uh. It was blue haze. I thought it was purple haze, but maybe I'm thinking of Prince. Peace. The debate over the foreign policy. Two uh, 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 doves. Hawks and doves. Inventors and vengeance. Um. Hey, random guessing. This is why Jeopardy's not multiple choice. Funny girl. Uh, um, don't rain on my parade. I knew it wasn't Papa. Could you hear me? Because that's Yentl. Thank you. Gracias. Gracias. Two, two, two books in one. A Christmas twist. Um, that was weird. 
Do I, is there a final Jeopardy? No? No, all right. Cool. Anything else to, to look at here? Play real episodes of Jeopardy. Let's not stream episodes of Jeopardy. Actually, you know what? I bought this game and it's terrible. Let's not ever do that. All right, I think I think we've jeopardied enough. Let's go back to full screen. All right, I think that's enough jeopardy. I think we gave this an honest try, and, you know, who knows? Maybe I will be the next contestant on Jeopardy. I don't feel confident in that statement at all based on what happened just now. But, hey, we can't always win when we do a thing. Join me here on Fridays on Twitch at 3.30 Eastern Standard Time or 3.30 Eastern Daylight Savings Time, depending on whatever time we're in, where I do a random thing. And if you have an idea for a thing you would like me to do, leave it in the comments below or jump in on Fridays and leave it in the chat. And I'll read the chat after I do the part where I end the YouTube bit. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Boop!